I just came across this article in the news. I'll put a link up for you so you can read it. There is what they are calling a dog pack terrorizing people in an area of the Washington State. This caught my interest because they say that this pack is so vicious it is out killing for fun. They've looked for it, but they can't find it. Someone just happened to capture some of the members of this pack on one of their security cameras. And this pack is on a killing spree, killing farm animals, and it's really awful, and people don't know what to do. They can't find it. They don't know where it goes during the day. It only comes out at night. And, of course, the residents are terrified that... Um, these things are going to start targeting children. What caught my interest was when I looked at the photograph, the one that you're looking at sure doesn't look like a dog to me. It looks like either a wolf or some very strange type of hybrid. So I'll just show you the rest of the image of it. It reminds me of a shapeshifter that I saw a couple years ago. I was with another person. I lived out in the country. We had been hearing very abnormal human screams during the night. And the whole area, there was something really wrong with the area. We did end up moving out of that place. But early one morning, I'd say around 5 a.m., we saw this thing walking down the road, and the gate it had was not the gate of a wolf or a dog, and it looked a lot like this thing here. I had been led to read the Rebecca Brown's book, He Came to Set the Captives, Captives Free, and she gets into a lot of issues that religious groups and churches absolutely will have nothing to do with. And her writing was from experience, things she had to deal with, things that she was taught by God in the Spirit to deal with. So I had just read that book, and so when I saw this thing coming down the road, way out there in the country, I said to the person with me, I said, that that's not normal. And we got into the car, we locked our doors, and we continued to watch. It seemed to be oblivious to us, although it did come up near the car. It went across the street where there was a lumber yard. There was an extremely high chain-link fence with barbed wire at the top. The gate was locked. Well, we were looking at each other talking. I looked back, and the thing was in the lumber yard. There was a bonfire that had been built the previous evening, and it was still smoldering. And this thing began frantically digging in the smoldering fire with its paws, and we watched it. It didn't feel any pain whatsoever. But the shape of it and what we saw really reminded me of what I saw years ago that I do believe was a shapeshifter. I'm going to put a link up for you to this article, and you can take a look at it. If you want to, look at it with a negative filter. I guarantee you, you will get chills if you do that. These things, I believe, are being turned loose on the populations. They say they can't identify the breeds within this pack from the photo. Killing for the fun of it, it sounds too much like the giant wolves.